Thank you for listening to today's quick tip. Let's talk a little bit about how we test function of FDS and FDP. FDS, or flexor digitorum superficialis, is the tendon that controls how your middle or PIP joint of your finger moves. The FDP, flexor digitorum profundus, is the tendon that controls how the tip of your finger moves. If you're looking to see if someone is intact or ruptured in these areas, here's how we do it. So because FDP works as one muscle with four strings or four tendons coming off of it, they all work in concert. So if you restrain your adjacent three digits and try and bend the finger, you'll see that FDP doesn't go. However, if you leave those fingers free and you try and bend here, then it can go. If you block there and the person gets no movement, then likely they are ruptured. If you go here, you'll see for FDS if that is ruptured. You don't have the same issue with adjacent fingers on FDS because that is four individual muscle bellies with four tendons. But to test to see if somebody's FDS is intact again, you hold their metacarpal still and their proximal phalanx still and you ask them to bend the finger and see if anything happens. If they have no movement there, you know we have a problem. Thank you.